morning everyone welcome to another day in my life as a software engineer in tokyo today i'm working from the office so i have to take a train to commute there it takes 45 minutes to get to my office which is actually around the average commute time here in tokyo Today I have a stand-up meeting in 5 minutes, so my meetings are usually in the afternoon. The reason being some of my team members actually work from outside of Japan, so there's this time difference and then we're trying to find the best time for everyone to have a meeting. I will need to join the meeting now. So I'm gonna have a one-on-one -on -one meeting with my manager in 15 minutes. Before that, I want to talk a little bit about how I got my first full-time job here in Japan as a software engineer. I got this job as a return offer after my internship here. So when I was a master's student, when I was in my first year, I joined an internship at this company where I was able to work for three to four months. At the end of the internship, uh, the HR asked me if I wanted to join as a full-time employee and then I said yes and then four months later I got the offer letter to join this company as a full-time employee. If you're a student in Japan and if you want to pursue a career in software engineering, I believe uh, one of the best ways to do that is by applying to internships or by joining internships before you graduated. So if you're currently not a student but you're thinking of applying for a job in Japan, you can start from LinkedIn. There are a lot of openings on LinkedIn. Other than approaching to recruiters and being active on LinkedIn, I also found a website called Japan Dev. Actually, two websites. I found a website called Japan Dev and Tokyo Dev. Those two websites are great in providing information for software engineers who are looking for uh, jobs in Japan and they have many jobs that allow you to use only English in the work environment. Oops, I'm almost late to my meeting, so I'll see you guys later.
it's currently 9 p.m. now and I'm just going to take a break for the rest of the evening. Today was quite tiring. I mean, working from the office is always more tiring than working from home, obviously because of the commute. But sometimes I do like working from the office because I can meet my friends, my colleagues. When I'm bored, I can also walk around the office. Anyways, I'm planning to upload more uh, Days in the Life videos in the future. If you have any questions about working as a software engineer in Japan, I'll try my best to answer them. I don't really know everything about the job market here, but I'll still try my best to answer your question. So that's the end of this video. Thank you so much for watching till the end. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.